Hi, I'm Rachel Simmons, and this is Real Girl Tip Number Nine. The teacher doesn't hate you. The curse of the good girl sets impossible standards for girls, telling them to be perfect at everything they do and loved by everyone. This makes mistakes feel painful and embarrassing. Now, sometimes when a girl gets criticized by a teacher or a coach, there's a thing she might say: "The teacher hates me." Girls who feel this way often get angry at the teacher and may even stop participating in class. When they tell their parents about it, mom or dad can get pretty riled up too. They might even call the teacher and complain. My advice to you and your parents is: put down the phone. When you say the teacher or coach hates you, you're taking a conversation that was about your performance and you're making it personal. This can be dangerous for a few reasons. I'm also a teacher, so I know what happens when parents and girls challenge teachers too much. We might feel like you're questioning our authority. And some of us might get nervous about telling you the truth about your performance because we're worried about an angry phone call from your parents. The person who loses out on all of this is you because you don't get the feedback that you're going to need to improve. Now, if you really believe the criticism is unfounded, that's fine. Sometimes it is, but talk to the teacher yourself. Don't have mom or dad fight your battles for you. Learn to advocate for your own interests. If you can learn to stop taking criticism personally now, you'll have a huge advantage in everything you undertake. So right now, think about this: How often do you complain about your teachers and coaches? Does the teacher hate you, or might there be another reason why he or she is saying this? Tell me about it at rachelsimmons.com. And for exercises to improve how you deal with criticism, check out my new book, *The Curse of the Good Girl*.